This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Danielle Davis with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. You could call it a sign that we're getting closer to the new normal as some area teens will again get a first-hand look at a possible law enforcement career. Bellevue Police announced they will host their Teen Citizens Police Academy this year. It gives kids ages 5 to 19 a chance to learn about police work. Directed health measures forced them to cancel last year's event. This year's academy will be June 2nd and 3rd. President Biden is looking to shift to 100% renewable energy by 2035, but that's raising concerns about those who have spent their lives working in the fossil fuel industry. Last, the latest numbers show the oil and gas industry employs about 100,000 more people. Renewable energy leaders say they expect 1 million more jobs to open up in the next five years, but admit not everyone who now has an energy job will be able to shift to a green economy one. We're going to need to be deliberate about helping Americans acquire the skills to fill all the jobs that will be created. The green economy requires different skills, and so we can't expect things just to work themselves out. Green energy supporters say the good news is once people develop the right skill set, there's room to make more money than in oil and gas. And I'm 3 News Now weather alert meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update. We stay cool, breezy and rainy as we go through the rest of our Thursday on Futurecast. The rain continues on and off as we go into this evening and tonight. Temperatures only warm back to about 50 degrees, so they don't move a whole lot throughout the day. Then as we get into Friday morning, morning finally the rain starts to taper off. And that'll allow us to uh, be a bit drier and warmer by Friday afternoon. Your Thursday, though, we see a high of around 50. Breezy still with those northwest winds gusting up to about 25, 30 miles per hour. Temperatures on Friday, though, will be warmer thanks to less rain. And we make it back into the mid-60s. There is another chance for some spotty rain very late Friday night into early Saturday morning. But most of Saturday stays pretty dry. Temperatures will still be in those low to mid 60s. Warmer on Sunday, closer to 70 for many of us. Before our next cold front comes through, drops us into the upper 50s by Monday. Looks like we stay a little bit cooler than average for most of next week. It's big cookie combo time. Get my big chocolate chip cookie along with the medium classic combo and the medium one topping pizza for a limited time. Big cookie combo. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.